Hello and welcome everyone to my channel Skanda Prasad. So this is a very important video again related to Comet K 2020 UGET. I'm sorry, Comet K UGET 2020 application process and the procedure of registration for Comet K 2020 exam. So let's talk about it. How do you do this and what should the correct procedure uh, so that uh, you don't miss out and you don't make any mistakes. So I request all of you to watch the video from beginning to the end so that you don't make any mistakes and everything sits clear in your head. And I. Uh, strongly recommend to ask your parents also to, uh, to sit with you who are applying with you uh, if in case uh, you know your father or your uh, you know guardian is applying for you so please watch this till the end so let's begin uh, registration details uh, the first thing which they ask is uh, name of the applicant so uh, make sure you enter the same which is present in your sslc marks card or your 10th board exam marks card that is report card so same name should be given with without any changes the same same is the case with your date of birth please do not make any mistake and the other most important thing which is email id make sure you give correct id or if any you know sometimes you know, while typing on the phone the first letter becomes capitalized so re remove that if if in case uh, your email id starts with uh, lower case letters and do not make such mistakes because it will be a problem later on and you won't get any updates from the comment queue official site because your uh, email id is wrong same goes with phone number also please uh, make sure you you know type correct phone number verified ones even if you know it is correct because you don't want to miss out uh, you know updates coming from the comet k uh, council the next thing is candidates uh, unique id proof select the id proof that the candidate will bring in original at the time of exam and administration process admission process from the list provided so that is provided in the comet k uh, website you, you should go and check it out there after successful registration uh, you will receive your uh, credentials that is id and password oops sorry yeah i think this should be fine sorry for that and uh, yes you will get your user id and password and that is how you should log in again into the website and then carry out the uh, application form this was registration for comet k next is application form so make sure uh, you do both the next thing is you should fill out again uh, some personal uh, details will be asked you should fill out the same thing again and then uh, they'll ask you to upload your scan documents which consists of your photograph signature of the candidate as well as signature of your father or any guardian which you have so that is very important i spoke more about it in the previous video if you have not checked it out please do check it out uh, which is present in the previous uh, video which is very important the next thing is uh, after uploading everything you know the details i have given in the previous videos about uh, what is the size of the images etc so you can check it out there or you can check it out online or in the comet k website the next thing is selecting your uh, preferred exam center make sure you select something which is nearer to you and give that as a preferred option so that you don't have to travel on the day of the exam or uh, previous day before the exam so make sure it is very near to you any near city if in case you are living in the rural areas so make sure you do it correctly next is paying the comet k application fee this is very important and the receipt will be generated once you have paid it you have to save that copy and get it printed and uh, do not lose that and application fee uh, is actually 1300 uh, it is uh, one sec pcm for comet k uh, application fee is 1600 plus 18% gst plus convenience charges for internet that is for internet handling charges and uh, This is a thing called as uni gauge uh, both. So if you want to apply for that, it it will be two thousand. Uh, it says two amounts two thousand four hundred six hundred. I request you to you know check once more with the uh, comet k website. There again it will be given. I don't know why you know two different amounts are given here. Or I'll confirm it in another video or I'll put it in the description box uh, if in case any updates are there. So after payment. Uh, i will take you after, after payment gateway will take you to the final submitting form where you should you know you can uh, revise once more whether everything is correct or not and uh, take a printout of this application form for your free future re uh, reference and uh, documents to be preserved after submitting the comet k application is your comet k admit card which will be generated and uh, comet k application form which you just filled and submitted photograph uploaded the same photograph you make one folder in your uh, system and uh, put all the you know marks card your photo your father signature your signature etc keep one folder which will be used for you know all the exams so make one and receipt for the payment so take one print out or keep the soft copy so this is all uh, you should uh, do using the this is the process of your registration and application for comet k ugt 2020 i hope you like this video please do like uh, share and subscribe and uh, do not forget to press the bell icon so that first notification whenever i post a new video goes to you 
Stay tuned for more updates on Comet K and KCD 2020. Thank you for watching this video. Goodbye.